All right. Viva la France. Here we are doing a playtest game at Chris's, who's French. Here's his list. It is pretty dodgy in terms of the writing and all this, but uh, why don't you just go through what the list is and more importantly, what each of the... Like when it says FMAS, is that their weapon? Yes. So the FMAS is a FAMAS. It's a 5.56 five, uh, assault rifle, just like the uh, Canadian C7 or the uh, American M16. Okay, so when it says FAMAS, that's like saying... A section of infantry. rifles. Correct, and they're equipped rifles. with uh, grenades and, you know, their own standard, standard equipment. Yeah, so Team Yankee infantry, so with Correct. all the fixings. Correct, correct. Uh, AMX-10P, that's the vehicle that is very similar to a BMP. Uh, Which is good, because since the f models aren't out yet, there will be lots of proxies over here. But we'll get to that. Correct. So you've got your HQ with uh, FAMAS and, some, and an AMX-10. And AMX-10P. Then I have two big platoons, right? The basic platoon is 7 point for 5 FAMAS. Two equivalent of Canadian or the Carl Gustav that most people know as it's an 80 40 millimeter anti tank weapon, short range. Okay. But the uh, the French have uh, normally two 89 millimeter uh, anti tank uh, weapon. For one point, you can upgrade to AP last. So these uh, have a better range. Yeah. And they have an anti tank of 21 advice uh, the 17 that the 89 millimeter would have. So for one point, that's for like one an point. auto include, yeah. Correct. And then for two additional points, each, plat each platoon can get uh, two Milan, again, uh, anti-tank uh, 21 plus yeah. three, three plus, sorry. And it comes with an additional AMX 10P okay. uh, with an additional 20 millimeter gun. And you have two of those platoons. Yeah, two similar platoon. Yeah. So big platoons. Uh, smaller than uh, the Marines or other armies, but still, but still. De still decent. Uh, then I have a, a tank of four, sorry, a platoon of four uh, AMX 30 as part of the... Infantry formation. So the AMX 30s are part of the, f the core as in the formation. Correct, as you see that. That's now. actually pretty cool. Yeah. Now, is it where they have to be like that? Or can you, if you wanted to have more infantry, you could have done that? I could have had two more infantry platoon and that platoon of tank if I wanted to. But it's nice to have the platoon of tanks integrated. Correct. Cool. Uh, what I did in support, I invested a lot of point in support. I want to test my theory that I put uh, in the article to come up. <laughs> So for Mep Mephisto, and that's equipped with the hot with anti uh, armor piercing twenty three, I believe. Uh -huh. uh, then I have a, uh, a small platoon of two VABs with four Milan. And the VABs, those are the wheeled trucks. Correct. They the, look a bit like BRDM twos. Right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Or but, the Fu isn't the Fuchs the German one with all the wheels? Correct. They look like correct, that. Correct. Correct as well. Um, I have uh, four Gazelle uh, equipped with the hot missile. Uh -huh. And I have uh, three uh, anti-aircraft, anti-helicopter, and, uh, you know... Anti-light vehicles. Anti-BMP yeah. light vehicle, which are the MX-13 DCA, my Geppards. Yeah, yeah, the French Geppards. Yeah, the French Geppards. Um, but, of course, we are proxying that, um, and we'll go through that. So the T-72s yeah. are the Shars. Yes. The BMPs are the... The uh, MX-10. MX-10P. Uh, the uh, uh, Spandrel, Spandrel will be my Mephistos. That makes sense because they look pretty close to it. Very much. Yeah. These will be my uh, VABs, so the four wheel, wheel vehicle. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the British uh, uh, will be Piat will be my Milans here. Yeah. The your French half tracks. We'll just say they're, they're really, yeah from way back here you can't really tell what they are, but yeah, French okay. half tracks. Your French half track will be my DCA. Yeah, and these uh, <laughs> four bases. Well, there's no be... gazelle. There's no models yet. I mean, no, what can no, we do? Those are going to be my gazelle. Yeah. I think the AMX thirteen probably actually weighs less than a World War II half track. Probably in, in, all, in all honesty. Probably. So the infantry section will be the FAMAS. Yeah. The platoon commander will be the fifth FAMAS. Uh -huh. um, the bazookas will be uh, the uh, the uh, Apilas. Yeah. And the British infantry will be the Milan. So uh, it's going right. to be visually easy to remember. S and it won't be easy for me to remember. But that's okay. So we are playing Hasty Attack on uh, one of your awesome tables with the awesome mats uh, going on. I've brought over some of my Team Yankee terrain, uh, some of which are winnings from playing at Cold Wars, like the car parks and I believe this apartment building right here. Uh, you as a defender picked this side to defend from. Um, I as the attacker, I'm playing my Soviet, so this is the battle... Um, uh, communism versus socialism. I'm running a list I've been running for a while now, so it's um, if you've seen this before, bear with me. Uh, I've got two Heinz, two massive 
um, companies of infantry uh, with 12 BMPs each, which is what's in the back. I've got a platoon of four Shilkas. I honestly didn't think he was going to take the Gazelles, but I just needed, in Team Yankee, um, reserves are still designed around number of units, so I wanted a couple cheap units. So I've got the four um, Shilkas, and I've got uh, some Spandrels and uh, three Storms. So this is the first time the Storms will ever see battle since I've painted them, which means they will suck completely. So that's the situation. We're playtesting the French list, and uh, we'll catch after, I guess, deployment. So here we are deployed. I've got infantry, BMPs, BMPs, infantry, and my Heinz. He's got infantry dug in, his AMX 10s behind there, infantry dug in, AMX 10s over there, and the Mephiston's in ambush. And we've swapped out the half tracks. You can see them right over there uh, for some 3D printed BTR 80s. So, mm -hmm. hey, they're. they're and they're in the right decade at least. So I rolled the uh, to go first. Um, so I guess I gotta drive up, kill off all those vehicles, and then take return Milan Fire and Appalas. But hopefully, I get my um, follow me orders on my infantry to get close and start machine gunning them with AK 74s. None of this fancy famous business. All right, my turn one was not very eventful. Um, this big giant motor rifle company did not pass its follow me, um, test on a Courage of 4 Plus. The BMPs, uh, road dashed up. This company did pass its, um, follow me in a 4 Plus, moved up, um, using the woods as cover there. Uh, these BMP2s opted to fire... Hitting on sixes at the AMX tens, um, I did pop two of them, and then foolishly, I had my Heinz over there. Um, he sh yeah. Before I shot into here, his three anti helicopter shots, of course, wiped one out. I shot with my one missile, missed. No, I actually, no, killed, I, I killed one. Yeah. And then I did a my step. Um, I ran away for the rest of the game. Uh, yeah. The fact that Italian fabric and wood biplanes are 10 times more survivable than hind D's, yeah, there's a problem there in the rules. That needs to be fixed because that's a load of shit. But that, that's how it is. And um, yeah, I should have kept him off board to shoot at his tanks, but whatever. So that's my turn one, and we'll see what he can do with all this infantry bearing down on these uh, reluctant Frenchmen. So real quickly, I didn't get any reserves. Um, sorry. Uh, I didn't get any reserves, which is something I failed to mention in turn one. Chris's turn one, um, now that there's no more air threats. Yeah. Fire the BMPs at the infantry uh, company, kill one base out. You mean AMXs, you fired your AMXs. AMX 10 p sorry, yes, you thank you. Uh, fired the two Milans over here, and yeah. uh, bail and killed one. Yeah. Uh, fired the hut uh, out of the Nephistos. Which uh, revealed from ambush there. Yeah, it revealed from ambush. I, I got two shots in, killed two two additional VMs. Sure no, did. Killed and uh, not killed two. No, right? you killed two more. Yeah, it was straight so, kills. So that should be like that. Okay, yeah. good. Yeah, the other bayonets over yeah. this way. So here. move my MX ten P from behind the hill here, uh, on the road, and um, I had a tremendous uh, hit ratio. I hit six. I was good at my armor saves. Out of eight, uh, but I bailed and killed only one. Yeah. And that's it. Uh, the infantry. It's front armor two uh, versus armor six, but at long range, so it's my armor three versus six. So I, I was pretty good. Correct. Correct. That's it. And you opted to not fire to stay not concealed fire, and yeah. gone to ground for against me. Yeah. So which is smart, knowing that Soviets will not actually engage in the assault because they're awful at it in the rules. All right. So my turn two. We'll see if I get any reserves. Ah. Right. Uh, need to make a statement so on my turn too yes we forgot or i know i did that bmp 2's guns are 80 80 10. Mm -hmm. so i was able to polish off the rest of these lads uh, by moving up and i also forgot the bmp 2's are rof2 on the move which is excellent news uh for the soviet player and not so good for the socialist player as i wipe out uh this unit here 
Um, these lads, the AK-74s, moved into the woods, shot at some missile teams, yeah. did, um, I mean, it did some hits, but he made his saves. The RPGs moved up, uh, killed one, bailed one, which is excellent. Um, over here, these BMP-2s, the three on the street, uh, I did remount. So those three missiled into the middle, killing one. The rest, um, the firepower isn't that great on the BMP-2 cannon, so I was able to double bail... Um, Double bail one and bail out the rest. So there's a test there. Yeah. And then last but certainly not least, I employed the horseshoe of AK-74 Doom over here. Um, three shots on the move, man. Uh, oh, you know what? Their firepower five plus, not six plus. Whoops. Oh, well. What do you mean firepower? Wh whose firepower? Five my, plus? my firepower is five plus, not six the plus. AK? Yeah. Oh. What's well, AKs and uh, the yeah. little grenade launchers? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So I didn't kill anybody, but I did pin them. Mm -hmm. uh, so if they don't unpin, I'll be assaulting next turn. Despite the fact that they're horrible at assaulting, I'll I'll have a chance. Um, and no, I didn't get reserves for the second straight uh, turn. So now it's his turn too. So I don't have to worry about gazelles yet. No. Uh, actually, it's at the end of the turn. Yeah, the uh, you have to test for this. Yeah. yeah, it's not. Now that we've got version four for uh, flames, they're reluctant, aren't they? Their morale is five, so they they, they go. They're they're gone. Yeah. That's good. Yeah. Soon the Mephistos will be next. RPG so, to cross a parking lot. So they just good, blow, right? Well, they're transports. They're like martyrs yeah, or whatever. No, no, you know, I'm okay. I'm or M one thirteens. No, M one thirteens have the. I don't have the 20 millimeter that can shoot at helicopters like those, but they do have 50 cows, which are pretty sweet. All right, so on to his turn two. So bottom of turn two is complete. Um, Chris wasn't able to remount the Mephisto. Unable to uh, unpin. unpin the uh, infantry over there, reluctant. Okay. Um, they were able to Milan the back end of my BMPs, but only bailing. Mm -hmm. um, over here, you killed like a whole bunch of uh, three RPGs, right. um, but more crucially, pinning them. Um, and you killed a whack ton, another three more yeah. uh, BMP2s, so they're about at half, but luckily it's not version three Flames of War. At half is no big deal. But yeah, I'm still not sure if I'm going to assault over here. I probably will, just for fun, but still a lot of shots for being pinned, so we'll see. So it's my turn three. We'll see if I get any reserves. Well, I think I get automatic reserves, but mm -hmm. my reserves aren't that good. It's I want your tanks on the board before I put my reserves in, to be honest, because it's all anti-tank stuff. But anyhow, I'll do that now. Ten shots permit. So I am assaulting, yeah, and he's defensive face. firing. How many so far? Five shots so far. So it doesn't pin me yet because I'm a large unit. So that's the Famuses. The, the missiles. Milans. Can they shoot with an eight? Uh, let me, no, the Milans cannot shoot with an eight. Do they eight. have rifles? Because I know... Let me check. I know my infantry teams have RPG 18s yeah. and um, AKs, so I don't know about you. It says that they assault five, guided heat, but they don't say... It's just written Milan missile, missile team. So they're just missile teams. That's then. right. Okay. And Apulas anti-tank team as well, so they don't have any... So they'll be able to shoot, because they shoot 16, but that's it. So the Milan can, but the Apulas can, so one. So one, so six. six. Okay, so at least it doesn't throw back the assault. No, you're not throwing back. All right, well, well, at least it didn't get, throw back a defensive fire, so we'll see what happens now. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. We'll catch the rest yeah, at the end of the yeah. turn. I just want to, in case I got thrown back, at least we got to see this um, huge disparity in number of teams, but yeah. All right, and to continue, uh, my turn three. Um, we already kind of covered my positioning for the assault. Uh, this is post-mortem after the assault. In defensive fire, he did kill four of my AK-74 stands um, with my swings, so... That left it to six plus hitting RPG teams, and they got some sixes. Killed two. Killed two, pushed him back. Um, he's pinned. Mm -hmm. He's still contesting the um, the uh, objective. Yeah. yeah, the objectives. Yeah, this is the uh, search radar for the geckos, the big, huge, gigantic six-wheel trucks. But that's my check. I like the morale issue. 
Yes, so one thing to, to know about the French is they have a high skill in terms of the three plus for blitz for doing moves. Yeah. Um, but they're they're real, they're basically reluctant. Correct. In, um, like the old uh, uh, reluctant veterans in uh, Flames of War That's version it. three. So they're morale five. Because now they're morale five. Now you'll be rallying, I think, on a four. On a four. Okay. But unpending on fives. That's right. Is hurting you there. Un remounting those guys. Was pretty low over there. Um, the rest of my turn, I did road dash some shilkas up. Um, I double build. Oh, I killed one build, one of the um, yeah. Mephistos. But I managed to roll the five. But I you did manage to roll the five. Over here, I couldn't unpin my infantry, so I dug them in instead. And I, what did I do with my BMPs? Shot your infantry did absolutely nothing, I don't think. Well, you made all your saves. No, you killed me. You killed Oh, yeah, uh, I did kill an Apple. An, an yeah. yeah. So that's pretty good. Um, but now your reserves come in. Yes. So we'll see what's what. And most importantly, if these guys unpin, you can MG the ever-loving hell out of these guys. Because once you're down to just the RPGs, it's no reason. Oh, you're only three for reserves? Yeah, reserves not coming in. Eesh. Dicey proposition for quick you. Game, quick game. <laughs> well, I'm sure people are going to comment, oh, the French are running away. Ha, 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 uh -huh. ha, how yeah. droll. Yeah. Right, end of turn three. Again, with no reserves, Chris's turns were pretty limited. You were able to... Kill one more. Yeah, and when bail I... one out. Yeah. Uh, over here, I think I, put, I killed another RPG. Didn't you I? did, yeah. yeah. The Hots didn't, or the Mephistos didn't remount. Nope. Um, nothing here. Oh, here, yes, BMP. Sorry, my a a AMX 10P. Yeah. Hit three times. Out yeah. Of, yeah, out of three shot, killed yeah, one. killed one. And um, then over here... Over here, I did uh, a lot of hits with the famous. You unpinned, dug uh, in. Unpinned, dug in, little, did a lot of hit. I killed one RPG mm -hmm. and three uh, normal bases. Yep. Still, I mean, I've got lots of teams here, but I'm running out of AKs to dig these guys out, so we'll see. So my turn five. Four, four. Four? Yeah. Yeah, that's right, four. See if my anti-tank reserves come in, even though you have no tanks on the board, which is going to be great for me. Not. Uh, on my turn four, these guys failed to unpin. I shot a couple of times into here, moved my BMPs into here to shoot his dug-in dudes, and I think I killed like one whole guy. So my bid to win right here failed. Uh, over here, my BMPs moved up, shot a bunch of guys... Killed, I think, a, a stand. No. Nope. Not even? Nothing. And then in... I did pin you, though. Yes. Which is the whole point of the endeavor. And yeah. then I assaulted in. And then in a flurry of incredible defensive fire, Famous Nine for the shots. win. Yeah. Famous for the win. You repelled the assault and killed uh, a couple of my stands Three there. Stands. So now your reserves get to come in. Yeah. Let's see. Um, no. Really? Yeah. Turn five? Turn four. Yeah. No, turn well, five. No, I'm about on turn four. Can't be. Where did you turn four? Hmm? You just did turn four. Whatever. You know what? I'm I'm always wrong in the videos. Like when I go to edit videos, I'm fine. That's fine. Yeah. I still think it's further along, but whatevs. So one more turn uh, until you get some reserves, I guess. Chris's turn. Man, the Famuses are... Ten shots. Ten shots. I uh, only killed a couple over here, yeah. but pinned them again. RPG and, uh, and a base. Yeah. Uh, however, over yonder, uh, the hot missed, the guy that got back in. Mm -hmm. um, and then over here. Nine shots. Double. Nine shots. You pinned me again, though. Yeah. And I think I only killed. Um... I know, but like, like, look how. I mean, I know I'm still outnumbering you, but. The Soviets need all of those bases all assaulting at once. It's like, now if I assault, I'm going to not. It, it's going to fail. Mm -hmm. Which sucks. Because I had my chance. And I blew it. So I don't know what to do now. Oh, I'll be unpin and go in again. That's the Soviet way, right? Can't let these French think that their <laughs> socialism is clearly not superior to the uh, Soviet way. Yeah, so on my turn, I had a horrible round of shooting over here. Chose not to assault, just I didn't kill 
I was hoping to kill more models, but uh, AKs wasn't a good day. Over here, my shulkas are chilling out beside the gas station. I went all in on this flank over here, moved my BMP2s up, shot my 20 mils in here, shot everything I had, assaulted, uh, pushed them the survivors back, but they were surrounded in a little corner back here and couldn't get out, so I captured them and then moved back up here. So now he's got, he's definitely getting reserves in. Mm -hmm. Let's see how many. One. One. So. And it's scattered, so well, one, no, two, uh, one. Yeah, well, normally you'd be like, well, maybe, you know, if you, these other dudes are still there, you'd have one more turn and you'd take the helicopters, but now. Now it's pretty important, right? Because if it's, well, first of all, what's it going to be? Your reserves, tanks. Well, it's going to be tanks. I think, it is. yeah, tanks. I mean, putting in your DCAs isn't going to do anything, no, right? Those tanks. red guys. So tanks. So one, two. They come in the center. Yeah, but the center is all the way across. That's right. So yeah, so you can move on here, drive up, contest, and start shooting it. Correct. Although now the fact that. But it's full of RPG. It was full of RPGs. It's true because he was trying to whittle down my AKs, and now it's. That's a yeah. It's a nest, Ugh. but it keeps going one more turn, and you should be able to wiggle that down. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, yeah. we'll see. It, keep, it continues on, so we'll see. Yeah, it does. So let's see what let's see what happens. Ouch! It sucks that your reserves haven't come on, and like your AMXs are now just mm -hmm. contesting fodder. That's right. Although, I mean, you can just MG the hell out of these guys yes. with their twenty millimeter coaxes. Yes, indeed. Indeed. But on the move, so let's see what happens. Yeah. So Chris, uh, let's go with some success. Yeah, so let's go with success, right? Victoire list 28. I, I fired everything that I could, and I think I put like 13. Oh my God. 13 shot into you. I'm down infantry. to four models left with, on the infantry. Okay. And if they go, my BMPs go. The a -plus killed. Yeah, another one. The, the hot, the, of course, the, failed the to hit. Failed with it. Miserable too. But the famous man. Correct. Famous all day long. And I'm going to... Famous, famous, famous. I'm going to do so many dudes. an assault on this, I believe. Oh, yeah, because... Yeah, uh, still that's can. still with an 8-inch. No, I'm not assaulting this turn. Next turn. I'm not going to give it to you yet. Over here, though. So he did get his uh, AMX 30s. Yep. And the initial plan was, okay, well, go in here, shoot at the guys that aren't dug in, and then with... What did you have? Ten hits? You no, hit once? No, eight hits. Hit, uh, hit once. Once. And I made my yeah. save, of course. So that, of course, stymied his plan. And then I was like, wait a minute. I know for me, any tank just literally just drives over my RPGs. Why? Because almost everybody's got decent side armor and then side skirts. Except AMX-30s. Would you recount what their side armor is, please? Side armor is four. Front armor eleven. No better than a Sherman in World War Two. Yeah. And I don't have any of the fancy skirts or no skirts or, or, or nothing rubber. like that. Yeah. Nah. The French like to go commando. Yeah. So no skirts or nothing. So assaulting that would have been completely foolish. So now he's got to sit and wait an extra turn. I'll probably evaporate them with all my BMPs. Correct. But but then he'll get more reserves. So then the hots will come in and the Milans will have to come in here. But I mean, I've got a lot of RPGs here. Really, he's just hanging on to inflict some more casualties over there to get some platoon kills. But it is interesting to see the AMX 30 is like, wow, yeah, and then the side armor 4. Jesus. All right, well, we'll go the next turn and see if I can't pull it off on this turn. Alrighty. Over yonder, what happened here? Um, my guys stayed pinned. I moved them behind the wall. I briefly thought about assaulting, except until I learned about their AT-13 anti-tank grenade launchers that they, everybody has, so hard no over there. And over here, predictably, all these BMP-2 missiles uh, finished them off nicely. So now we play the reserves game again. He needs some reserves to come on over here, yeah, or fine. else lose the game. Well, you for sure get one, but let's see if you get both. You get one. And your gazelles can't contest, yeah, five. Yeah. so it has to be the Milans. Or, or my uh, the, actually the mix thirteen. They may be better. They may they be can, better. They can fire at close range. Yes, and my guys didn't dig in. No. So, so, so four. No, let me see. 
four, four so. which is the middle. So that yeah. means they can come in. So they're gonna come in and shoot those BMP in the ass. No, I need to contest you this. You need to contest yeah. it, yeah. I'm gonna get killed again. Here What's the anti tank value of them? Let me see. Uh, AT so these are supposed to be AMX 13s with AA guns strapped to the yes. top. Yes. They're my Geppards, but they're French far Geppards. From Geppards. They're seven anti tank, right. five plus. Awesome. Well, yeah, nobody has Geppards. Like, I know, I know, I'm kidding. There's nothing that's Geppard in a Geppard. <laughs> I mean, my Shilkas, which are supposedly like super feared, are like, oh, they're just anti tank six. Just a couple of shots. Like, so the Geppard is a thousand times better than that. So, my, 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 my stuff is one point better than yours, then. Because I have anti tank seven. Yeah, you're just looking up the stats now on the phone. Because, again, we're playtesting. Yeah. So, I'm front one, side one, uh, top one. I'm hit on four. I have anti tank seven, five plus firepower. How many shots on the Five shots outed, three shots moving. I would try and blitz them on. Yeah. Yeah. Because they're high skill. Yeah. So. They do. They That's do. Yeah. So there you go. Five shots five apiece. Shots a piece, so that should five. finish at least the infantry. Yes. <gasps> you know what? In a, in a brilliant display, if you wipe out this infantry, guess what goes? Oh, yeah. All the BMPs. That'd be awesome. So. Yeah. If it's on, just, yeah, just make sure one's contesting and then yeah. you're fine. Well, gee, suddenly there's nothing on the field over here. He was able to MG the ever loving hell or famous the hell out of the surviving remnants of that um, motor rifles and it cleared out um, the left behind teams on the hill and it cleared out all the surviving BMPs. So, well done there. Um, for these guys here that unpinned, he took a Milan shot and glant, or bailed out a Shilka. And over here, even with 15 shots with the AMX DCAs, quote unquote only hit nine, but I ma then proceeded and made uh, eight out of nine mm -hmm. uh, saves, infantry saves. So the plan here was to remove these guys and get rid of this threat entirely again, but he's still contesting for one more turn. Still has gazelles to come on, so I think. You can probably get another couple platoons. Like a gazelle will be able to take out, you know, a small platoon of those, you know, spandrels or something like that. But I mean, now I'm going to evaporate this, so yes. that's going to be the end of that. So his guys that moved to famous my guys in the previous turn now got shilked. Yes. And it was brutal. I got a ton of hits and he failed so many saves. So, my Shulkas finally are hitting something. And over there, yes, the AMX 13 DCAs were uh, dead. Expected. Yes. But you know what? It did actually take my BMP2s to do it. Um, the RPGs couldn't pull it off. So, he's going to lose the game when my turn starts. Mm -hmm. But... Gets his gazelles or his reserve. Milans. Yeah, just one reserve. Oh, no, you know, your Milans could contest it for one more, and then the wow, gazelles. Yeah. The Milan, yeah. No, you're right. I could move and dug it. Uh, no. I blitz. can blitz dig in. Blitz and Let's dig in. Let's do that. Let's... The Milans? No. Oh, they, they failed the blitz. blitz. Well, then they're walking on. Yeah, they're walking on, so... Well, first, let's see if they're over there. Yeah. Because you might roll a five or six, and they might be over here. A six. Oh, so they're over here. They're over here, says you. GG. And they're moving, so they can't fire. Because they failed the blitz. Congrats, dude. All right, congrats. Um, the French. What do you think of the French, Dan? Um, the AMX-30 is not so great. No, it's not. It's a Sherman. <laughs> you know what? It is a Sherman. It, it'd be great in the 1967 war. Oh, wait. Those guys have Shermans then, too. Yes. Yeah. <sighs> well, you've played, you've played the, the French twice, and so since we're playtesting, we may as well just kind of go through... I mean... You had, I mean, the gazelles never came in. The yeah. stuff that did come in in reserves weren't in their element because you were you were forced to, you know, contest, contest, contest over here with my Correct. my infantry bum rushed you. Correct. With a lot of anti tank, right, left here and anti tank yeah. left here. So well, your AMXs weren't able to make a dent into here. No. And when they were up this Correct. Main, main street here. Correct. First, first of all, uh, AMX does not have the firepower of the BMP. No. Yours has a ten versus my my six. Yeah. Uh, my tank doesn't have any armor, so can't resist. 
your your anti tank weapons. Most I, th I think it has the same front armor as a Geppard. No, almost. Yeah. That's how sad that is. Yes, it that the Geppard is so OP. Yeah. That it's almost as good as your main battle tanks. Correct. Yeah. And arguably has better side armor, I think. So Geppard. the again, this is what this was a tough scenario to play test a, a list because most of my army was in reserve. Uh, right. You know what I mean. Your infantry, but you know what? We did see the hell out of the infantry. The infantry, they were the hero of the game. The FAMAS, the anti-tank weapons they have, if you place them properly. And those if grenade you launchers. Them in, they're awesome. Yeah, so we did discuss, hang on also, sorry to interrupt, but the placement of the two different missiles. Yes. So explain that with the ranges and everything. Well, the ranges of the APLAS is 16, and the ranges of the Milan is 36, but the Milan has a minimum of 8, so... Uh, stagger them, having the APLS up front, pushing the enemy further, keeping the enemy out of your eight-inch minimum with the Milan. Because otherwise, so people otherwise people just like they do against British, they just bum rush within eight of the Milans, Correct. and that forces and you know, and also even if somebody does that to you, with your high skill, you can three plus blitz backwards and still shoot them with Correct. the the missiles. Correct. Now, am I correct but in then, assuming? But then, then I'm losing my dug-in position. Like, well, I know, but I mean, yeah. at, at desperation time yeah. sometimes. Yeah. And now, is it correct the Apalas does not have a minimum range? The Apalas does not have a minimum range, okay. nor, do, so, nor does the 89mm uh, anti-tank weapon. Like, yeah. it, so the only one that does is the Milan. The Milan. And the Milan, most people that have played Team Yankee, are, they know the Milan because it's in a bunch of, you know, it's a NATO weapon, so it's yeah. been in a bunch of lists already. The Hot Missile yeah. uh, also have a great range of 48, but it has a minimum of 8. As well. well, that's very and and the stats uh, that's very much like my Sturms, which didn't get to fire a single shot. Um, but yeah, so they're eight range, high range, um, eighty twenty three. I think you said correct. Um, the French infantry uh, in this in this list, uh, they're they're great. They're honestly a, a good a good strong uh, formation. Mm -hmm. But if you push me off the push me off the objective. It's hard to get back with a morale of five, and counterattack is also five. But, but they I, were able to. Well, no, what was it though? They have a morale of five, but they were able to rally on a four plus. They rally on a four plus. That said, if you have your formation commander, the formation commanders of the French are awesome. Their skills are uh, two. Their morale is two. Their rally is three. Their counterattack is four. So if you can have your commander with your formation. Put him in there, and, and you're going to have a great, great, great. So you almost want maybe two infantry formations to get two commanders, maybe. Potentially. Potentially. Um, Stats-wise, I know we didn't play them here, but stats-wise, how's their artillery? The artillery is, uh, as I said in the article that you, you guys may read on Monday, mm. it's um, uh, it's good. So the template, the template artillery, and of, of note, mm -hmm. I have no mortar. So the only template artillery I have is the... Hey, AMX. welcome to Soviets. We have no mortars either, Correct. apparently. So AMX AUF1. Yeah. Um, so they're, they have an autoloader. So when, once I've templated and, and you're under... Ranged I in, get yeah. Ranged in. I get uh, minus one to hit anyone under the template, which yeah. is good. Um, they're, I believe they're two plus. I, I don't have them with me right now. I believe they're two plus uh, in terms of firepower. Uh as I said as well in the article, if you have marauding tanks, uh, don't don't hope to kill them because all you have in direct fire is anti tank fifteen. Yeah, I'm just wondering. Apart from the, how many Mephistos can you have? Because you can only have a platoon, and that's I, what I, I thought. I maximized it at four. Yeah. Is there any other? Like I know the for the Soviets, you can get. There's a couple other ways of getting the Spandrels. So the Spandrels are. The lesser missile between the Sturm and the, but you can you can actually get I think two units of this depending on the no. formation that you take. In, in my list, the French don't. The, in my list, there's two anti tank platoons that you can get that are on on tracks or wheels. They're actually they're both on wheels. Is the anti tank Milan platoon on VABs? Yeah. So four wheels, and you have the Mephisto with the hut also uh, on a VAB vehicle, four wheels. Mm. Two. That's it. The rest is uh, the, the gazelles. Killer. Gazelles with hots. That's that would, not bad. Those would have been hot. And they have yeah. hunter killers. Is that the? So do they fly like cobras? Uh, Where they can still go underground after correct. they shoot correct. behind terrain. Correct. So that's a third platoon. Yeah. 
Uh, it's just, it just it means you don't have good tanks. But I mean, with NATO allies, you could. But I know you're not going to want to do that. Nope. No. Okay. So it'll be interesting to see. Um, what about Mirages? They have the Mirage fives. I think were fighter bombers rather than anti tankers, right? Well, the Mirage. They're not like Mirage two thousands. The of Mirage later's. five does two things. It, it can it can bomb you, and it's got great stats to bomb. And, and it's got a 30 mil gun, which only an eight inch range. So like every other plane. Yeah, and it's yeah. it's a uh, and it's got an anti helicopter role with that gun. Yeah, I th most most planes have that. That's it. So that so it means they're run of the mill, which I mean they are. So they must they must be reasonable points, unlike the A10. Yeah. Cool beans. Well, thanks for the game. Um, in hindsight, we maybe shouldn't have done a reserved uh, scenario just because that. We didn't get to see the you be able to have the combined arms yeah, on like the table. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Like you still have you still have units all off board, and you yeah. basically had to sacrifice all these units all in a row right. just to prevent my winning. Yeah. Um, I think it also goes to highlight um, my latest um, quote, quote unquote latest strategy of you know trying to bum rush with infantry, and that's been working. I mean, it's not giving me all sorts of wins, but. It's giving me more wins than I used to have when I, you know, trying to out tank people with T-72s. They're just badly, I don't know what it is, badly point costed or just the other ones are better for the points. Just T-72s, Soviet T-72s just aren't that great for the points. They're not T-64s. But I mean, I don't have any T-64s, so. All right, dude, thanks for the game and... Uh, Thank you. Yeah. So it looks like communism beats socialism one, one last time.